yes. Right now, I'm going to talk about Revelation 2.9. This is very important. Now, when it says Jewish, the Christian, the Christian religion didn't exist then. So it's not going to say Christian. It means, it means it's going to be fake Christians who are trying to fucking be in God's name. Whoa, I got a fake Christian responding now who's in a glitch. That is perfect. Because when Revelation 2.9 talks about fake Christians, where they don't care about poor folks, they try to attack drug addicts, they try to attack everyone in ways that God would never approve of, in ways that Jesus never showed. But then they still claim that they're Christians. And it's just a pack of dogs where they just lower the standards and lie to themselves that they're accepted because they have no real connection to God. So when it says synagogue, it really means the church of Satan, which isn't the church of Satan that's a real thing. It's the church of Satan being that they live for self and they don't care about anything about, except they don't care about anything except doing the weakest thing. So they do the weakest and easiest thing to appease their conscience and pretend they're a good person. Where only the smart ones get to heaven, and that's not you. If you don't understand these things, these things, these things do not know that they're evil. These are things that have no clue that they're evil. They're that stupid. They don't know they're evil. And they have a cartoon version of evil which compounds their stupidity and delusion. So they have a cartoon version of fucking evil thinking evil is a man who in a black hat tying a woman to a train track just to be evil. Or it has no, it's not even a mature meaning to what their definition of evil is. It's just retarded. So that's why you are trash. If you don't go around saying, what does that mean to you? If you don't go around saying, I don't trust you. What does that, what does evil mean to you? And then seeing that everything is simple minded because the simple mind proves they don't have a soul. So what you need to do, you need to look at, you need to look at anyone in your church and say, what does evil mean to you? And then it's not about you being a fake Christian or like the Revelation 2, 9 says, you being a fake Jew. Or it's not about you being a fake fucking Christian and trying to get them right so they can go hurt someone down the line because that's all you're doing. As soon as they get your support, they don't even try to better themselves. All they're doing is trying to find someone who you and them can hurt or someone that you don't care about they can, that they can hurt and they can still be a hero to your eyes or still look like a good person to your eyes. They're your dog. They're not a fucking person. They're your group's dog. Where they're just looking for any rabbit to t chase that the master gives them a bone for it, or a squirrel to chase so the master can give them a bone because it is not a person. They're just a dumb, soulless dog human who don't know anything. And someone not looking closely once upon a time said, hey, maybe you're a good person. And then it, it fucking fucked their brain up. And they took that shit to heart. And now they're trying to live up to that standard that they're a good person and they could never earn it. So that's what Revelation 2.9 is explaining too. They're, that it's going to be fake Christians who are just serving themselves. Who are just worried about looking like a big shot. Using religion for vanity. And using religion for a social status. And that's what it means. When Revelation 2.9 means that. So you can see that in your churches. And you can mark them motherfuckers easily. Now I'm going to go to this soulless fuck. This soul as fuck is mad. Look, she's basically Charlie Zellner. She's basically Charlie Z, whatever this motherfucker's name is. She's thinking she's undefeated. Her dumb ass is just thinking, even though she's weak as fuck, flawed, don't understand shit about the Bible, this sorry fucking bitch, Heather Evans, this sorry fucking bitch, is sure that she's a Christian. She's a perfect example of one of these fake ass Christians. Look at this sorry welfare fucking Christian. And just, and just trying to do gaslighting techniques where she don't care about anything. Religion hurt you somewhere down the line. Someone who calls themselves a Christian showed their true colors. It's hit you in the middle. <laughs> Basically trying to play the hero. Just trying to protect their facade. You're just trying to protect your facade. This is how you don't play a game with these monkeys. You're just, you're just protecting your facade. That's evil. <laughs> you're, just, oh, you're just protecting your facade. <laughs> Oh, that's wrong and evil too. Everything you do is evil. <laughs> that's wrong 
and evil too. Everything you do is evil. Think about it. That's all you have to put. It takes two seconds. Everything that they do has a hole in it. Because they're a dumb soul as fuck. And they can't see how fucked up they are. Every single thing they do has a hole in it that they can't stop seeing. Everything you do is evil. They're wrong and selfish. Think about it. Think about it. You're the fake... You're the fake... Christians. You're a fake Christian... Archetype. I'm driving while I do this. Archetype. That... Revelation... 2... 9... Warns about... Words up. Everything is self. Everything. <laughs> everything you do is selfish and only helps you. It's self. It only helps you be weak. <laughs> Yet you swear you're a Christian. Yeah. You swore you're a Christian. You're a Christian. Just pure evil. Just pure evil. What? You got you're gonna get right later? Your sorry fucking ass is gonna get right later? What? You're gonna get right later? <laughs> There's an off chance that you're gonna get right later, <laughs> and you can and you can fucking disagree with the logic I say. There's an <laughs> that's something. <laughs> Be sarcastic. Be sarcastic. That someday, once upon a time, <laughs> you're gonna get right later. <laughs> <laughs> Get right later. You're broken as fuck. You're broken as fuck. Huh? And then I'm gonna put the picture of Revelation 2 9. Huh? Let's say this is all you have to do with any soul as fuck. Where they're 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 mush brains because they're not people. It mushes together everything. So they can't differentiate between deviant behavior and criminal behavior. They can't differentiate between their feelings and their physical pain. That's what science proved. They mush physical pain and mental pain together and they can't differentiate between it because they're not a fucking person. You gotta recognize all the science God has given you that he's given to the scientists where they do this research. They are like eight out of 10 motherfuckers can't tell the difference between physical pain and mental pain but not everyone and it's always going to be less like it's less motherfuckers playing in the nfl it takes it takes more work so that gate keeps to be a good person takes more work being a fake christian they they just turned everything around where now everyone's going to heaven if you just say empty words you don't have to believe or that your actions don't have to match think about how stupid that is i'm going to end on that note Think about how stupid that shit is. Basically, now you get to heaven by just gaming God and saying empty fucking words you don't even believe in. <laughs> it's like, you you can picture him. I'm going to do a skit. You can picture the, the dumb, soulless pieces of shits together. Saying, hey, hey, I found a new lick. All you had to do, because God is so stupid, all you had to do with this new lick is say, you know, those things that we never mean, those, those sounds that come out of our mouth. <laughs> like ooga booga, or that, 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 or woof, woof. You know those sounds that us animals be making? We found, I found a new lick. All you had to do is just make some of those sounds, and God's so stupid, he let you into heaven. I'm going to do some of them for you. Let me do some. Jesus is my savior. But, yeah, yeah. Whoa! Are you telling me that's all it takes? <laughs> yeah, 
that, man. That's all it takes. All you have to do is just say, Tony Ocean is a guy so stupid, he lets you in the heaven. <laughs> I'm going to do another one for you. Because I got the word. I'm going to do another one for you. Have mercy. <laughs> you see? Now you do. Okay, okay, okay. Get down to my tape, y'all. Have mercy. Yeah, 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 you got it too. Now we all going to heaven. They're so fucking dumb, they don't know that that shit makes no fucking sense. Because they are not a person. Think about it. This shit is proven. Them motherfuckers ain't people. There's no way you could be that dumb and be a person. That's that's below a level of human intelligence. A monkey can be that dumb, but not a fucking person. And not even all monkeys. I don't even want to insult all monkeys. All monkeys are not that dumb. <laughs> Them things are not people. A squirrel is that dumb, but not a fucking person. The motherfuckers ain't people. And Revelation explains it all. They're in a church saying, my church. That church don't mean shit. There's a church full of shit anywhere they're at. And the preacher is full of shit. And he's just stealing your money and stealing their fucking tithes. And that's the fucking truth.